Did you learn anything new from this experience? I learned that 17 year old boys are really violent. <laughs> <laughs> Apparently somebody passed out in the middle of the restaurant, yeah, and so they're closing yeah. early. Yeah. Yeah. What's going on guys? Right now, I clearly am not home. I am actually in Las Vegas at the studio that I train at. I have decided that I'm actually going to compete at World Championships this year, but I'm only gonna do one event. What that means is that I have to come here and train for a week, and the training is very, very, very hard. It's torture. So this year's Worlds is gonna be a little bit different. It's not about me. It's about the two families that we have raised money for to send to World Championships for the first time, because it is literally an unforgettable experience, especially when you go there for the first time. And the two families that won, we are going to meet them at Worlds, interview them, and we'll take you guys along for the ride. Anyway, I'm gonna go back to getting tortured by my uh, instructor. I'll go like this, and it's a big difference. Now get that leg out a little bit more. There's a huge difference between that and this. His form is craziness. It's really cool. I told you that was inspiring. I'd say one of the worst ways my instructor tortures me and the other students is the 20 minute stretch. You heard me right, 20 minutes. Hey Lexi, what tortures us the most in training? Probably the stretch. Yep. This is Brandon. Hi. He, if you uh, have seen my previous video of Game of Flip back home, he was in it and he won. What is the worst thing that your mom does to us? Everything. All right guys, let's go! Gang your splits! No! Guys, let me tell you why this stretch hurts so bad. You are forced to stretch 100% of the time for 20 minutes constantly because gravity is what's pulling your legs out into the stretch. So when you're doing it up on a wall, it actually stretches you a lot more than when you're doing it on the ground. So we're just gonna sit here for 20 minutes and let our feet go numb. When it's done, that's that's when we scream the most because it hurts. Oh. <laughs> no! <laughs> Paige, go push Ethan down. I don't deserve this. I'm already down like... Far enough. Why? 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 Roger, <laughs> you got this. Everybody gets their last little push now. Ah! Ow. Oh no! Oh. You have one minute 40 seconds! Okay, you're almost there. I've never been in this much <laughs> Five, four, three, two, oh. one! Oh my god! Pulling a dead body. All right, well, it is 6 a.m. and today is the day we head to the airport to go to World Championships. I am so excited to meet everybody, say hi to a bunch of friendly faces I haven't seen in a long time. All right, finally made it to the hotel. I have not eaten yet, so I am going to be having some food. On our way to team practice, West ATA always has everybody practice a couple hours before the competition so that we can get ourselves good and ready to give ourselves the best possible chance of winning. So that is what I'm off to do right now. I've actually rested all day just to prepare for this because training itself is quite the workout. Yeah, they tried to do it when I was sleeping. <laughs> Let's do this! Let me explain what you're about to see. Best in the world are competing for the world title, and that's what you're about to watch. Go, go, go! 
was great to see. You guys rocked. Every Woo! one of you. Thank you, ma'am. We've been doing it together a long time. Woo! Three, good five, Trevor. First place world champion. So I got on the podium and I pulled out a pretty decent form. I'm really happy with it. And this dude, Get up there. where's the medal? Oh, I forgot it. That was bloopers, bloopers. Max was bloopers. bloopers. I got second. What did you get? I got third. Nice. So is this your first time on the podium in Extreme Creative? This is my first time. That is awesome. Make sure you check out its channel at Ninja Pie. Links in the description. Check it out. So hold up. What is this AT First World contest I keep referring to? The AT First World contest is something I set up where people could actually donate to family families that have never been to AT World Championships before. It's an amazing grand tournament and we actually raised enough money to help donate over a thousand dollars to each family to help pay for everything to allow them to go to this grand tournament. So we are on our way to meet one of the winners of the AT First Worlds contest, Nicholas Yoder. All right, looking for Nicholas Yoder. Nicholas! Oh! What's up, babe? Hi! How are you? Good? Good you guys. Hello, sir. How are you? Good. Oh, good. He was so excited. Yeah. <laughs> so, guys, this is Nicholas Yoder. Hi, my name is Nicholas Yoder. I would love to go to Worlds because I think that it would be an experience that I will never forget. How does it feel to be here? It is insane. I'm excited. I'm nervous. Is this your first tournament? No. Okay. I have been to three other ones. Have you ever been to Phoenix before? No. Also, this is my first plane ride. You've never been on a plane flight until? Yeah. Yeah, I've never been on a plane wow. before. Yes. Tomorrow is competition day. You're nervous? Yes. What are you competing in? I am competing in forms, weapons, sparring, and XMA weapons. Nice. Okay. I guess we'll get some video uh, of you competing, if you don't mind. Only, you know, a few hundred thousand people are going <laughs> to see it. No pressure. I mean, it's just, mm. just you two. Eek. <laughs> 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 on our way to opening ceremonies. are the biggest contributors to the AT First Worlds contest. There's about $300 you donated. And Devonte, Same. Devo. <laughs> Devo. About over 600 Oh Is it my. 600 in total? I think so. Holy cow. Guys, we could literally not have had two families go to this event without these two. So I just want to say thank you so much. Yay! I'm just happy to be able to make sure these guys get a good experience. They certainly did. This is Nicholas. This is his first world championship. He competed earlier today, and guess what he won? I got first place in weapons and second place in um, forms. I didn't get a first place when I went to my first Worlds. And the second winner of the ATA First Worlds contest is right here. This is Megan McClanahan. Hi, my name is Megan McClanahan. I am a first degree black belt. I would be so happy to have the chance to go to Worlds. So we've interviewed Nicholas. Now let's interview Megan. She has just finished competing. How did you do? I didn't place anything. For combat, I lost by one point. And for traditional, I lost by two points. So you were close. You were really yes. close. Nice. Did you learn anything new from this experience? I learned that 17-year-old boys are really violent. <laughs> I think what I definitely learned when I first started competing was that competing against people who are better than you make you better. So after this, do you think you want to continue doing more tournaments? One million percent. So what part of this whole experience so far has been your favorite? My top two would probably be sleeping in the bed. It's too really It is the best. Meeting people that I've never met before. Nice. Is this an experience you will never forget? Yes. I don't even have the words to be able to explain like how everything was. I'm glad you enjoyed the trip. This is Ethan Feintrapper from Action News. Back to you. All right. Well, thank you, Ethan. Right now, we are actually at, what's this place called again? Element. Element, okay, yeah. Right here beside me is Daniel Rivera, three-time world champion now? Five-time, actually. Five-time world champion, holy crap. He's gonna be here training with us, so what do you have to say about that? Um, I'm excited. I hope the session goes well, and I hope I don't get hurt. He better not get hurt. He's gotta compete tomorrow. <laughs>
nice. That's awesome. What was going on in your head? Um, I was like, dang, I do not think I can beat the kid that went before me. I was nervous. I was anxious. So yeah. Well, congratulations, man. Thank you. I'm so glad you did really well. All right, we're gonna go get some late night ice cream. I heard this place is really good. It's w within walking distance of the hotel. Oh, Apparently wow. somebody passed out in the middle of the restaurant. Yeah, and so they're closing cool. early. And we got just in time to not get any food. Happens. So. Oh my God. Hi. <laughs> <laughs> That's basically the end of the vlog. Thank you so much for watching. Comment below if you like these kinds of vlogs and you want me to make more, let me know. Subscribe to Ethan Fine Striver. Post notifications. Comment below. I don't know. I'm not gonna... all that Comment down below all that good stuff. And super like. <laughs> <laughs>